This here is my no hit 100% kill run of the ultimate doom on ultra violence. Check the description for the rules I'm following. Check out the end of the video for outtakes. This is E3M2, Slough of Despair. The first thing I've got to do here is grab a shotgun. This is a very busy level and I can't do without a shotgun. I'm going to use the pistol to get rid of all these guys here and hopefully not get shot. We need as many shotgun shells as we can get our hands on. So I'm going to take out this Kako Demon, grab the shells behind him and then slowly eliminate all the enemies I see coming towards me here. The idea behind this is basically to get rid of as many of the enemies at the bottom of the level as possible so that they're not left wandering around. If they're wandering around, they could potentially follow me up and hit me later on when I'm not expecting it. And also you can see that there's quite a bit of ammo dotted around here, so it's a good way to get my reserves up. Take care of this spectre here. Now I've got to be really careful because there are some zombie men who are wandering down from up there. There is a chain gun around the corner there, but, you know, sometimes I grab it, sometimes I don't. I'm just going to go into the maze here, take care of the two shotgunners there, making sure no one's sneaking around. Oof, that lost soul. <laughs> yeah, this level's very easy for people, for enemies to sneak up on you. As you saw there, that lost soul really fancied a chunk of my face. We'll take care of this pinky here, grab the shotgun shells. I'm just looking around here, making sure that there's nothing that can attack me. Nothing can really get me inside of here that I can't see, so I'm going to let the enemies come to me. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there's quite a few lost souls dotted around this level, and it's really annoying. Luckily, there's a rocket launcher there, which I can make use of later on. The Berserk Pack is pretty useful. There's quite a few pinkies on this level that I want to take care of. Another Kako Demon here. Just keep our distance. Don't mess around. Grab the armor just because... So, there should be a yeah, bunch of shotgun shells here. We're going to get rid of these lost souls here just because they are a pain in the ass. I think there's a secret here. Yeah, there is. There's a plasma rifle inside. Again, going to be very useful. Want to get rid of that Kako Demon. As you can see, that wall's coming down there. There's a whole bunch of lost souls around there, which I'm not looking forward to. Trigger that so I can grab the ammo from in here. And, yeah... I guess I'm going to have to do my best to take care of these lost souls here. So yeah, these guys guard the exits to the level. While we're not going to be heading this way yet, it will make the end of the level a lot easier if I... I am playing a bit silly here, so I'll just get rid of you. Get rid of you. Yeah. Oof. So yeah... There's a bunch of shotgunners on the left here. I have to be careful because they can stop to shoot me if they really feel up for it. That's why I'm not really giving them the space to do that. I'm just taking them out like this. Very cheap way of doing it, but you know. There's one at the end there I want to get my hands on. I do want to grab the cell there. You can see it. Um, some, but I can't seem to get the angle here. Come on. Uh, okay. Try again. Take my time. God. <laughs> oh my god. Watch as I struggle to get up here. Right. The cell ammo here is going to be very important. Um, Got to be careful here because there's a lot of enemies here who could potentially cause me problems. I'm going to switch to the plasma rifle. As you can see, there's a bunch of lost souls and there's... Yeah. There's a bunch of enemies in here who I don't really want to face head on. So I'm going to use the pistol and stay far away from them. Luckily, when you shoot the Lost Souls, they stun lock like this. So we can just shoot them and take them out slowly. Take out the Kako Demon here. Yes, we're doing this with a pistol, but, you know, it's better than using the Berserk Pack. Because the Berserk Pack is kind of unpredictable. Especially with um, Kako Demons, because they can bite you when you get too close to them. You see that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> I'm really tempted to, but I'm like, it's really not worth it. Right, so luckily now this door's available. I know there's a trigger around here to drop all those shotguns there. Let's try to see if I can find it. Luckily I can run behind and grab the ammo here. Going to use the rockets here to take out the Kako Demon. Hmm. I know there's a way to do that, but I guess like... Um, I, I've just forgotten it in the moment, to be honest. So we're going to head up to the blue key here. 
a bunch of Kako demons are going to come out here to play. Take those out with the plasmas and the rockets. So we're going to click this. This will open up the back here, which will allow a bunch of spectres. Nice amount of ammo in here. We like it. We like it. So there's just this bit here, which we need to go through. Take care of the lost souls around each of these corners. These guys can be really nasty if you don't know they're here. Take care of you. So yeah, when I go around this corner here, I need to be careful because the wall behind me opens up and a bunch of spectres come flying out. So what I'm doing here, I'm taking care of these guys because you, it's very easy to get sandwiched here by that wall opening up, as I just mentioned. It's kind of a nasty little trap. Oh no, it's not spectres, but it's lost souls. But you, you know, you get what I mean. They could have easily followed me up there and I would have been trapped. So we'll take care of the spectre here. Nice. So as you can see, there's one more enemy left here. Um, I'm trying to remember where that enemy is. Um, goodness. I'm going to go quickly glance through the maze, make sure I've not left anyone around. You can see here, I'm just glancing around. I know where it is. I haven't gone and got the chain gun. I actually even I even said I was going to go and get the chain gun. But yeah, we've killed all the enemies here, but I'm not going to let these lost souls get away unscathed. But yeah... That's all the enemies killed. We didn't get hit, which is really nice. Uh, we didn't even need the chain gun in the end. That's pretty sweet. Very fun level, like when you're doing this challenge, because there's a lot of places for enemies to hide. Thank you very much for watching, and yeah, hope you subscribe and like if you want more of these videos. See you next time. Here's the reason one why I hate this level. Wandering enemies. Thank you very much, zombie man. Here I get hit right at the start of the level. Here you can see I don't really manage the enemies in the maze very well. And as a result of that, when I'm trying to fight other enemies, I end up being hit by a caca demon that I don't see. Yeah, this is one of the reasons why I don't like this level. So you can see I'm shooting that caca demon there. I wander around. And yeah, there's another caca demon here.